Hello, in this video I'll be showing you how to answer the answer 2016, section 1, question 54. We are given the structure of ethanol. Given the equation below and the overall entropy change for the reaction, what is the bond energy of the CO bond in ethanol? So our reaction here is ethene plus water goes to ethanol with an enthalpy change of minus 45 kilojoules per mole. And we're given a list of bond energies for various bonds. So to answer this question, we need to first see what bonds have we broken and what bonds have we formed. So I find it always best to draw out the compounds in the displayed formula. So we can see with ethene, we have broken the pi bond and in water, we've broken one of the OH bonds. And in ethanol, we formed the CH bond and we formed the CO bond. Now we need to find out the energy of the bonds broken and the bonds formed. So the energies of the bonds broken can be done by adding up the energies of the various bonds. So we have 464 coming from breaking the OH bond plus 611 minus 346. So why do we do this? This is because this is not the energy of the pi bond. This is energy of the pi plus sigma bond. And here we have the energy of just the sigma bond. So the difference between these two values will give you the value bond energy of just the pi bond. And this will give you a total of 729 kilojoules per mole. And we know that bond breaking is an endothermic process, so it's a positive value. It's because you need to put energy in to break the bonds. Now looking at the energy of bond forming, so we have 413, which comes from forming a CH bond, plus X, which we'll say is the bond energy of the CO. So since bond breaking is an endothermic process, therefore bond forming must be an exothermic process. As energy is given out when we form bonds, so it will be the negative of the value. So the total enthalpy change will be the sum of the energy of bond breaking and bond forming. So we have 729 minus 413 minus x. We rearrange that to find x. We have x is 729 minus 413 minus delta h. We are given delta h in the question as 45. So x equals 729 minus 413 plus 45. And that gives us the bond energy of the CO bond as 361 kilojoules per mole. So looking at our list of options, we can see that the correct answer is C.